Hi folks, this is Max from Epic4GTouchRoot.com. So I've got another ROM review of the codename Jelly Bean ROM. Um, actually, this is my favorite now. Uh, I've got tired of running TouchWiz crap, t crap whiz. Um, so it's about phone codename 4.1.1. You get the latest Jelly Bean. I like it because it's really fast, uh, much faster than any TouchWiz base ROMs. Um, and also 3G, 4G is working just fine out of the box and also Netflix is working, Bluetooth is working, pretty much everything is working. The developer noted charging notification lights out, but not a huge deal for me. Um, so everything working pretty good and I think this is one of the best ROMs you can get. Um, also, you know, battery life should be pretty good. Now let's go into settings. Um, let's take a look at some of the stuff you can do with Codename. If you go to interface, you'll be able to change all of this stuff. Um, you know, add custom carry label, kill all button, hold back to kill. These are all very useful. Uh, very similar to AOKP ROMs. And also, you can change the power menu to increase, in, um, add screenshot if you want, like that, and get rid of it if you don't like it. So that's what you can do. And a ton of other things. Um, notification power widget. Uh, this will also, you can customize these buttons. Now there's only five. Let's say you want to add. 4G button or something. Uh, let me see if there's a 4G button. Yeah, there there is already is. Let's say you want to add brightness and airplane mode. Now you got a bunch of more toggles. It's a great way to customize your uh, power widget there. And uh, let's look at status bar. Um, this one, this one pretty boring except for this brightness control. This is I love it. Um, now we can do is uh, anytime you're indoors in a club or something, you can just go like that. Anytime you're in the sun, you can go like that. I mean, it's so cool. Do this all day, high on Android. Um, so that's really cool. So definitely make use of that and some more stuff. I'm not gonna go into all of them. Hardware keys. You can change some of the stuff that your keys down here do. Uh, sound display. Um, notification light. This one's pretty big. You can actually use custom values uh, and add applications. And let's say you want. Um, certain certain LED color for your application there then you can change this to let's say red let's see if it works actually uh, you can test it out there you go you saw the red real quick there there you go so you can do this with a bunch of different applications and have different colors so you know it's Facebook notification Gmail notification Twitter notification all of that you can do here under display um, and more stuff that you can do, but I'm not going to go into all of them. Let's go to performance real quick. Processor speed, this one does not come with uh, overclockable. I actually recommend underclocking because this ROM runs so fast and you can save some more battery life uh, by underclocking it. And uh, also you can get a bunch of different themes on Play Store. Go type CM9, CM10 themes. Uh, CM10 themes or AOKP themes, you can install those themes and uh, it'll show up here and just apply it. And also the launcher home screen. Um, this one you can change the number of number of uh, uh, apps you can put on the the home screen. So right now it's four by one two three four five. Um, you can change it to almost you know six by six if you want to. You can mess with that. Um, let me see home screen. That's for the home screen. I don't have any apps on my home screen right now, so I can't show you that. Uh, but you can mess with that. General, auto rotate screen. Um, that's pretty much it. But codename, great ROM. I love this ROM. I have it on my Galaxy Nexus, uh, some of my other phones, and uh, love it. Um, you know, this ROM really makes your phone faster. It also gives you Jelly Bean. Um, codename is kind of uh, 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 let's say like a stepchild of AOKP. Kind of, yeah. You can think of it that way. But I love it. Uh, everything is working out of the box. Um, so go ahead and try it out. Let me know what you think. And uh, if you're like a, if you want a pure Google ne um, Google Nexus experience, this is the ROM for you. And even if you know, if you haven't tried this these types of ROMs, you should try it because the actual interface is much faster than any TouchWiz based ROMs, and love it. You know. So check it out. Uh, and also the camera works just fine. And uh, let's try the, the video camera. Yeah. So everything working out of the box. Love it. Uh, ROM of the week. Epic 4G Touch. 
Thanks, guys. Um, if you have an Epic 4G Touch, as always, don't forget to sign up for my email list at epic4gtouchroot.com. We update you once a week with ROM of the Week tips, hacks, and more. And also, it's a great way for you to get in contact with me if you have trouble with your phone. And also, it does landscape because it's Android 4.1.2. And also, you do get Google Now, which I forgot to mention. San Francisco Giants score. The Giants lost to the Cardinals. And also, if you hold down the menu button, oh, it doesn't do anything. I thought it was going to give me something. If you hold down the search button, it'll give you Google Now. All right. So anyway, thanks you guys. Hit that like button for me here. Subscribe button up there. Stay high on Android and share this with your friends on Twitter, Facebook, or Google Plus. Yeah, and go Giants.